Hello again everyone, this is Tim Buell for GottaBeMobile.com and I'm back with another iPhone video tutorial. Today's topic is a very common one. What do I do if I forgot my iPhone passcode? This is a little bit of a tricky question because there's not too much you can do. I've seen this issue quite a few times and there really aren't too many ways to get around it. Fortunately, you don't want it to be easy to get around. This is a security feature and you wanna ensure that you're not gonna have someone be able to easily break into your iPhone if and when it ever gets stolen. The best thing to do first and foremost is try to rack your brains and think if you actually did change the passcode recently or if someone you share the phone with, including a child or another family member, has also changed the passcode. If you try enough times, you'll actually get a disabled message and enough attempts will actually give you a longer disabled message up until the billion hours I've seen as people have continued to try incorrect passcodes. At this point, if any recent codes are not coming to memory, you're going to have to restore to the device. Now, there's an option to restore to a more recent backup, and if you're using iCloud or iTunes to consistently backup your iPhone, this might be the best option and you can restore back to a time where you know the passcode was working. However, if that's not the case, the only other option is a clean restore and setting the phone up as new. Make sure that you always have a current backup so you can avoid this issue in the future. Hope you found this helpful and hopefully you can get your iPhone up and running again.